During the winter trimester, our main text was The Odyssey, which at its core is a story about one man's journey and overcoming obstacles, which is a universal theme. So for their main writing assignment, each student had to think of a challenge that they had overcome in their own lives, uh, big or small. On today's agenda, uh, we're going to go through the projects first. I'll explain how that's going to work. And they spent several weeks developing that story into a strong personal narrative. For the final project, they had to find a way to take that story and retell it in some new media or some different format. So uh, this is my project and it ties in with the Odyssey because this is my first island and it's from a long time ago and it shows me that I had a challenge when I was younger and in the Odyssey when Odysseus was very young he did have the challenge of having to leave his son and Penelope alone. Learning spatially helps me by seeing what I have to do. I think in terms of patterns much better. I like doing the project this way for two reasons. First, it helps the students understand that no matter how they think, even if they aren't very verbal, they have ways of telling stories and their stories are worth telling. The second reason I like it is that each of these options, maps, monsters, songs, all tie in culturally to the Odyssey and the reminders that we as people have been telling stories in these different manners for thousands of years. This project helped me understand the Odyssey because it's like a personal challenge that everybody goes through and it's when Odysseus went through a personal challenge from getting back home to Ithaca to see his wife and family and everyone has their own challenges or maps or roads ahead of them.